gang, FLX Beer Reviews, back with another episode of As the Beer Swirls. My name's Dan. My name is Mike. Dan, it's this adorable little beer we're about to invite. Oh, Michael, this yellow, obnoxious yellow can. Wait, I love yellow. What am I? T you love bananas. And apples. Apples and apples bananas. Apples and bananas. Uh, no, uh, this is from the Warhorse Brewing Company, <laughs> Ooh, located right. in Geneva, New York. Uh, this is their Operation Little Vittles, which is a marshmallow cream ale with vanilla and lactose. Okay. So basically, I'll save Warhorse the trouble, because I can say it and I won't get sued. And it's basically cream ale that's supposed to taste like peeps. Like there's, you know, peeps. It's Easter. Sounds... Peeps. You like peeps? I used to like peeps. Um, uh, yeah, I'm really curious about okay. this beer. It's, it's uh, interesting. Really fresh, canned on 315, 2022, so we're okay. only a couple weeks out. Yeah, we're not um, that far, basically. so. Um, ABV 5.2. Okay. Um, Those little vittles are a crusher. So listen, Warhorse always puts on, like, amazingly, oh, yeah. like, just crazy great labels stories and descriptions and, and album that was the album and pairing and this is bg and hi-fi by benny goodman what do you know about benny goodman mike uh, he, he used to be an average fella but then he became a good man alexa play benny goodman here's some music by benny goodman on amazon music Well, then, let's get this beer in the glass here yeah, so we can drink it and see what it tastes like. We sure do love a good cream ale, and even if it's got marshmallow, it tastes like peeps. <laughs> We're sure to dissect it and see what it tastes. <laughs> oh, little vittles. Little vittles in my glass, Dan. Top of the morning to you. Oh, boy, we just got Irish up in here. We did. It's all right, Alexa, though. stop. What a fine tune that was. All right. That is a uh, kind of hazy uh, golden. I see the peeps. Floating around in the yeah, it's like they're, they're dead it. carcasses just floating in there. They've given themselves to the flavor of the beer. There's <laughs> like a, a peep slaughterhouse out back I'm just sure. marching them in there, <laughs> punching them in the head with a nail. This is like the premise of like some like rated R Pixar movie. Uh, yeah. They're yeah. so just like, Ooh, we're up to go to Easter time, and the, and the, they just get trapped by the warhorse people. They're like, "You're going in here!" And no, no, don't boil me, don't boil me. But but the warhorse brewer, he's like, uh, remember, uh, what was his name? Uh, Goofy's neighbor, uh, Pete. Pete, the big the big dog. Yeah. Guy, he's the warhorse guy. Go, oh, you get in there, you little vittles. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what this beer looks like. Yeah. <laughs> um, it's, I got a nice fluffy head. Yeah, it does. It, listen, it's got that cream ale vibe oh, and look yeah. to it. It's but a just, great cream ale You can tell it's got a little something in it. A little, little adjuncty goodness. Peep appendage. Let's go away. Yeah. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh man, I'll, t <laughs> I'll tell you what. That it's a sweet, fluffy marshmallow. <laughs> Oh, that's interesting. I'm at a crossroads here. Okay, what do you got? I have a two-year-old. Uh, yes. That we use baby wipes on. This is getting interesting. And you open up the baby wipes? <laughs> is that right? There's got okay. a little baby wipe smell to it. I can, I, I can I feel see like I where you're your coming package. from. I see Late, Listen, coming later from. on I'll do it for you. I'm not saying that it's a turnoff. Because no. baby wipes are meant to smell pleasant. But this has a slight baby wipes kind of... I'll tell you what. I do smell the base cream ale. Yeah, it, it, it's grainy. Yeah. There, there's a grain to it. Yep, but in, in a sweet topper, if you will. I'll tell you what, I'm not a fan of peeps. Is that one of those things where you liked them when you were younger and now no. you're like, meh? No. Oh, really? I, see, I liked I them when I was younger and now... I never liked it. I couldn't get past the texture. Oh, okay. Yeah, I can understand. I like marshmallow. I just the texture of the peeps. Okay. Something weird about the peeps. Okay. All right. Well, let's uh, let's dive in. Cheers. Cheers. Here we go. Holy sweet! Oh my goodness! Wow. Cloying is that is that the is that the definition? Cloying. It's peeps. That's the outer shell of the that peeps. Is the inside, like. 
I'll tell you what, the, they, the, they nailed the Peeps flavor. Wow. That's impressive. That's impressively <sighs> just <sighs> diabetic. Okay. So, I just felt my blood sugar spike th thrice times over. Oh, man, it's it's like my lips our are buddy, sticky. Our buddy Jeff would have really liked this. He has a big sweet tooth. Okay. When it comes to beers and stuff, he would. I think he'd really enjoy this. We might have to get him some of this. Unless he hates peeps. We'll ask him. If he likes peeps, Jeff, we'll get you some. Yeah. Um, that is... I've lost I've lost the cream ale base on the, the, the tongue. See, for me, I was going to say... The peeps are sitting on the front of my palate, mm -hmm. whereas the base cream ale is on the back of my palate. Like, I still get... There's, like, a bright kind of a lemony grain, uh, like, a shortbread cookie kind of... Oh, I like the shortbread cookie. Kind of a deal to like it, that. like a shortbread yeah. cookie. Mm -hmm. I, yeah, I think you're you're right. I think the the cream ale grainy aspect has turned Mi into a, with like a the, Girl the Scout piece. shortbread. Because there's that hint cookie. of vanilla or yeah, whatever. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. You're right. So right, okay, right. to 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 recap, we have Girl Scout shortbread cookies and baby wipes. So if that sounds pleasing to you in liquid form. <laughs> This is the beer God for you. Damn it. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, I'll tell you what. Okay, so let's rate it. Okay, be, uh, this is going to be one of those beers where I'm going to have to give a personal reference, a personal rating, and a rating for the beer. I'm ready. Personal rating. I'll give it like a two and a quarter. I I, I don't even think I can finish this. It's not for me. Okay. It's way too All sweet. Right. On the beer side. I think I'd have a hard time not giving it a five. It's exactly what it says it is. It is a cream ale that tastes like peeps. They nailed it. If you like sweet, crushable beer, I mean, I think this is, like you said, if Jeff likes sweet beers, if he's got a sweet tooth with yeah. like a little bit yeah. of a, a crispy boy background, that's it. If you like, nailed it. I feel like sweet things. Uh, okay. Uh, I'm right there with you. I'd give like a three. Okay. A personal rating just because I'm not a big sweet guy or maybe not in this form. I think if I, let, let's say we were at War Wars as, as and a, they gave us a taster. I would love a taster. As a beer, I'll give it a four, four. Okay. Yeah. I mean, I, I'm, I feel, I feel like I'm going nuts giving it a five, but it's just, it's exactly. So on the personal says. aspect, I'd like to see what it's like without the lactose. Just give me the marshmallow cream ale with yeah. vanilla. Uh, and yeah. without the lactose. It might Maybe be more of a crispy bring... boy. I think I'd like that better. I think I think that might cut down. Because we didn't even talk about the body. Yeah, you're right. I don't think we did. It is it is smooth and creamy, and for mm -hmm. the ABV, it's it's kinda it's got some viscosity. It does. Stuff. I think you forget that it's such a, yeah. a low ABV beer. Um I mean, Warhorse, you freaking diabolical. Warhorse, we love you. Jeez, we love you, beers. We love you guys. Uh, we, we can't like them all. Um, but this but, was fun to try. But I can see how cool. a lot of people are going to really like this. Yeah, absolutely. Um, this would be a fun beer to bring to Easter dinner and be like, hey, fam, check out what I got. Everyone gets a little sip. Dude, you show up with a little Easter basket with all the grass and the trees, but you got like a four pack of this in there. Ooh, and people look at pull that. It out. And these are free ideas here from FLX. So Benny Goodman would be proud. Absolutely. Um, all right. Yeah. So that's all it. Right. Down in the description below, <laughs> Instagram. FLX Beer Reviews, Twitter, FLX Beer Reviews, Untapped, My Untapped, His Untapped. Check us out. Leave us a message, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And uh, yet again, another... Another uh, fine beer from Warhouse yeah. Brewing. Thanks for watching, everybody. We appreciate your viewership. Cheers. He's crazy.